Welcome to Wyala's big reveal. Wyala is a proud city and is set to capitalise on one of the biggest opportunities in our history as we transform into a global contender. I stand here today with the permission of my elders and on behalf of the Bangla people, past and present, to welcome you here. We would like you all to acknowledge and respect the land and waters of Wyala as the cultural and spiritual home of the Bangla people. Our spiritual relationships with this country and our cultural beliefs are an important focus of our past, present and future. Over the next decade, Wyala will be transformed, fueled by growth in all sectors and intensely watched by the world. And make no mistake, this will happen. We are Wyala. Thank you. Since Sanjeev Gupta and his team arrived, we have seen a transformation, a transformation in the confidence uh, here in Wyala and the ambition for this city to once again uh, be a powerhouse of industrial activity, not only for the nation, but for the world. And I would like to acknowledge the leadership of Sanjeev Gupta. It's a win for Wyala. It's a win for South Australia. And it's a win for Australia. And a stronger economy for Australia. And what you're doing here, Sanjeev, what you're doing here, Wyala, is making our economy stronger so we can make Australia stronger and we can make Australia the great country it is and always has been. Thank you very much. And I think sometimes it takes someone from outside to remind us occasionally how lucky we are and what we need to do invest in ourselves in the future. Thank you very much, Sanjeev. What you also show is the future for this country. Cooperation, not conflict. Renewable energy working with heavy manufacturing. The economy and the environment working together. Sanji has given this place a whole new burst of enthusiasm and belief in, our, in ourselves. And let me tell you, Sanji, that we will not be found wanting. This community is up for the challenge. It is up to making a bigger, better whaler, a bigger, better steel plant, uh, a, a more vibrant community. On behalf of Waiala, thank you for making this day very special for us. It's a great honour. It really is a great honour for me, for GFG and for Waiala to have this amount of attention. And it really will help us, spur us all along in terms of our ambitions and our journey. I'm quite used to looking for diamonds in the rough. But here I really truly did find a diamond. I found a diamond which was in many ways to me obvious. We have a place which has all the natural resources it requires to make steel. We have the best natural resources for renewable energy. We have great infrastructure including a unique port. And most of all, we have a workforce who was willing, who was willing to fight for destiny itself. We had a management team who was committed and we had political leaders who were willing to support. And I said about my journey which brings us to today. The innovative Wyala Transformation Program will see the current operations evolve into a modern, world-class, sustainable facility, producing an impressive 1.8 million tonnes of high-quality, high-end steel each year. The construction of new processing plants and the upgrade of current facilities will create a safer, more environmentally friendly and globally competitive facility. So a new mill is now to be commissioned. We will sign today a contract for a new mill, the jewel in the crown, with the world leading Daniele. And I'll ask my friend Anna to come and explain a little bit about their technology. We are proud to be here to celebrate uh, with you the launch of the new structural mill, which we will, be, will be built thanks uh, and with GFG Alliance. This mill will produce one point 8 million tonne per year of large rounds, rails uh, and structural sections with the most advanced technology the world has on offer. The community has been absolutely, I have no words to describe how committed and how driving it has been uh, in terms of our, our aspirations. And it is important that together with 
the council and the community, we make Waila a place which is an attractive place for people to come and live, to, for people to educate their children, for people to want to have a long-term future in this. So this development, wh whether it's uh, GFG's developments of, or all the other developments which will happen in Waila are not possible without the commitment of the council, the city and the state. So I'm thankful for that and I will ask Chris, the CEO of the council, to come and explain a little bit about what the council has in store for us. Thank you. Sanjeev, I'd like to thank you for your vision in recognising that Waila is destined to be an economic powerhouse, not only for Waila, but for the region, for South Australia, for Australia and the globe. To achieve this, we're about to embark on developing and delivering one of the nation's most comprehensive and innovative City Transformation Blueprints. Australia exports something like 850 million tonnes of iron ore, hundreds of million tonnes of coal, yet that, those raw materials would form more than 500 million tonnes of steel, yet we make less than 1% of that steel here at home. So we are now going to announce a very audacious, a very brave concept of building a large steel plant, built on the foundations of the transformation project, built on that journey which we're starting now, built on making the 1.8 million tons. Alongside that, we will embark on a journey for a new grand scale steel plant, one of the largest steel plants in the world here in Waiala. Our cutting edge transformation plans are just the beginning of what GFG Alliance has in store for the region, a state of the art next gen steel plant. Designed to produce 10 million tons per year, with the capability for further expansion, this highly advanced plant will reimagine the future of steel making from the technology used through to the skills of its workforce. It will be one of the few plants worldwide existing on this scale. Thousands of job opportunities will be created throughout the construction phase, utilising local skills as a priority. Thousands more jobs will result from the plant's ongoing operations and we'll see a new generation of steel makers proudly competing on the world stage. This ambitious, visionary project demonstrates GFG Alliance's commitment to the city and its people and reflects our desire to transform Wyala into both an Australian and global powerhouse of industry for generations to come. Almost all the large steel plants which have been built over the last couple of decades have been built in China. So now I will ask the president of uh, MCC who has flown specially for this occasion from China to, to be with us to explain a little bit about uh, what they do and how they're going to help us. 工业集团强组织精兵强将充分发挥在钢铁领域的丰富经验与GIFG到全力将SPIS钢厂打造成全球最具竞争力的绿色工厂和智慧工厂。MCC Group will arrange for higher caliber professionals who will make best use of their abundance of experience in the steel industry to make it a high quality project an environmentally friendly project and build the Liberty Primary Steel Wanyana Steelworks into one of the most competitive integrated steel producers in the world. Thank you very much. We've come to the end of our formalities. The one part that's so important is the signing of the contracts. We are Wanyana. We are a city of opportunity. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.